Hi friends, welcome to biologyexamsorry.com. Today the topic of our discussion is cell analogy. Example, cell compared to a factory. So this is a structure of an animal cell. There is cell wall in the case of plant cell which is made up of cellulose and it can be considered as a surrounding wall of the factory which will prevent the intruder's entry and offers protection to the inner structure. In the case of animal cell, the outermost boundary is the cell membrane or plasma membrane. Cell wall is absent. Cell membrane is different from cell wall as it can be considered as a guarded gate. It is selectively permeable allowing only certain members or certain molecules to pass through. So it can be considered as a guarded gate where the person's credentials are checked and allow or deny the entry of persons into the factory. Then next is a floor that is a cytoplasm. Cytoplasm can be considered as an entire premise or area of the factory where all the activities of the factory takes place. In this case of cell, cytoplasm is the region where all the organelles are present. Then there comes the nucleus, the controlling center of the cell. Nucleus can be considered as MD's or CEO's cabin where all the decisions are made, where all the instructions are stored for the smooth running of the factory. In the case of cell, nucleus is a site of storage of genetic material DNA all the instructions for the making of all proteins that is required for the cell is residing inside the nucleus as coded as DNA. Next, close to the nucleus is the RER or rough endoplasmic reticulum. It can be considered as a center that is close to MD's cabin where products are made or proteins are made using nanomachines called ribosomes. It is called as rough because it is studded with ribosomes. Ribosomes are protein synthesizing machines. So it is a site where products are made and polished. Further modification also takes place in RER. Next comes the Golgi apparatus. Golgi apparatus is a sorting center of the cell. Once the products are made, it should be dispatched to the correct locations. The addressing process takes place in Golgi apparatus. Next comes the vesicles that is pinched off from Golgi apparatus. Vesicles are can be compared to as packets containing products addressed at Golgi apparatus. So the products are made in RER, it is further modified and it reaches Golgi apparatus. In Golgi apparatus it is properly addressed. These proteins may be required in nucleus, may be required outside, may be in mitochondrion, may be in lysosome, etc. So this should be properly addressed or chemical tags are given and these are packaged inside vesicles and dispatched. Next comes the mitochondrion. It is the organelle that is responsible for providing all energy that is required for carrying out all activities inside the cell. It can be compared to an electricity generator of a factory or powerhouse of a factory where electricity or energy that is required for all activities inside the factory is generated. Next comes the lysosome. As a part of all these activities, numerous waste products are produced and this should be disposed properly. There comes the role of lysosome. It can be considered as an incinerator where digestive enzymes are present which will degrade and dispose or recycle the waste materials that is produced as a result of metabolic activities that takes place inside the cell. And finally in the case of plant cell there is a kitchen or canteen where food is synthesized and it can be called as chloroplast. Chloroplast is present only in plants. The only organelle which is capable of converting light energy to glucose or food so that there is a kitchen inside a plant cell where food is made. All organisms in the universe is directly or indirectly dependent on plants for their survival. So this is a summary of comparison of cell as a factory. Cell wall in the case of plant cell can be compared as a surrounding outer boundary wall. Cell membrane can be compared to guarded gate where guards will check and allow certain members to pass through. Cytoplasm is the entire area of the factory. Whereas nucleus is an MD's office or chief executive officer's office where all instructions or decision making center. RER is the site where products or proteins are made and further modified. Whereas Golgi apparatus is a site all these proteins are properly addressed, sorted and dispatched. And dispatching method is by using vesicles or small packets that is properly addressed at Golgi apparatus. Mitochondrion is a site where energy is produced or ATP is synthesized for all activities of the cell. Lysosome is a waste disposal site. It can be called as an incinerator. In the case of plants, there is a kitchen or food producing center that is a chloroplast where photosynthesis takes place, where light energy is converted to 
glucose and that is used by all organisms in the universe hope things are clear thank you so much for watching you are with biologyexamsorry.com